I'm Joshua Wilson, Corporate Relationship Manager at America's Warrior Partnership. There's a lot of debt that you undertake when you start a business. Um, there's certainly a lot of labor that you have built up or you've lost. If there's been, you know, people who have transitioned into other roles or people who have moved, a lot of people have come together. Um, a lot of employees have come together and said, you know, I need to restructure my household, restructure my bills. And, you know, what's widely referred to as the labor shortage. And it, the thing about it is, is it hits, labor shortages hit small businesses much different than they hit bigger companies. And, the, and some of these entrepreneurs may have started their business three years ago with the expectation that they would only have to pay their employees a certain amount. And so with inflation and with higher demands from laborers, these smaller businesses really struggle trying to make it. And what's specifically interesting is small businesses are not Scrooge McDuck that you might picture, you know, the head of some crazy corporation. They are people who very much so care about their employees and they want their employees to find success because they're also sort of struggling against the grain. Like that's your typical entrepreneur. What's interesting is many of the entrepreneurs I interviewed said, you know, my employees think that I'm hoarding this wealth, but this labor shortage hits me so hard that sometimes I'm staying, you know, in a, in a motel that's $25 a night and it's got, you know, you know, very substandard living conditions, or I'm napping in the car and I'm struggling harder than I ever did when I worked a nine to five, but there's this dream that I'm pursuing and I want the people who I hire to be a part of it.